There's a large number of different creatures living in this world. Some of these animals are very small, and some are truly big. In prehistoric times, there were giant creatures everywhere. They were so huge that even the largest individuals of the currently existing species wouldn't be able to compete with them. Nevertheless, both are very interesting. And in today's video, you will learn about the largest living being of all time, as well as other huge creatures in the entire history of Earth. Barrel Jellyfish What do you imagine when you hear the word jellyfish? Or rather, what kind of jellyfish do you see in your mind? It's probably a small one, right? It's highly unlikely that images of human-sized jellyfish pop up in your head. But such jellyfish actually exist. The barrel jellyfish is an excellent confirmation of this fact. It usually reaches 40 centimeters in diameter, but in some cases, it can grow up to 150 centimeters or more. In 2019, a record-breaking giant jellyfish was encountered by biologist Lizzie Daly, who was diving off the coast of Cornwall in the UK with underwater filmmaker Dan Abbott. The two divers have shared impressive footage of the incredible human-sized jellyfish. The barrel jellyfish aren't entirely safe creatures. They are venomous, and their sting is rather unpleasant. In the case of the huge barrel jellyfish, its sting would leave a mark about the size of a plate. The skin would turn red, swollen, and be sore for several hours. The Giant Oarfish There are many fish in the seas and oceans, but not every fish can compete with the giant oarfish. Looking at the pictures where it takes several people to hold this fish, one might think that it was photoshopped, or that the fish wasn't real. But that's not the case. The giant oarfish really is very large. It is the longest living species of bony fish. The average length of the fish is 3 meters, but fishermen often come across individuals 6, 7, or even 8 meters long. The largest recorded fish had a length of 11 meters. Its incredible dimensions even got it a spot in the Guinness Book of Records and its second name, the Ribbon Fish. It really does look somewhat like a huge ribbon. The giant oarfish is considered to be the prototype of the legendary sea serpents. Scientists believe that in ancient times, when the giant oarfish weren't yet discovered as a species, Fishermen got extremely frightened when they saw these fish because they mistook them for evil monsters. These fish aren't monsters, though. Fortunately, these creatures are of no danger to humans. Firstly, they live rather deep, and secondly, they feed on crustaceans, small fish, and squid. The Giant Squid while the giant oarfish is considered the prototype of the sea serpent, the giant squid is the one that was mistaken for the sinister kraken. Maybe the kraken really does exist and lurks somewhere in the unexplored depths of the sea, but there is no doubt about the existence of the giant squid. These huge cephalopods have been of interest of scientists for more than 100 years. The scientists continue to find it surprising that these creatures grow up to 14 meters in length. The giant squids have eyes the size of a large plate, and their weight varies between several hundred kilograms and half a ton. These big guys don't like attention and prefer to stay at great depths, namely several hundred meters deep. Although sometimes they do rise to the surface to pose for the cameras. Tylosaurus this monster could easily give any person a heart attack. But we don't have to worry about it anymore, because it's been gone for a long time now. Tylosaurus lived on our planet 85 million years ago, on the territory of modern America, Japan, South Africa, Antarctica, and Russia. It was a huge mosasaur, up to 15 meters long and weighing over 8 tons. At one time, it was the largest mosasaur in the world and one of the largest creatures overall. The name of this sea monster can be translated as a knob lizard. 
The choice of the name was influenced by the elongated shape of its jaws, which scientists believe was used as a ram when hunting for large prey. Apparently, the Tylosaurus rammed the victim, stunned it, then ruthlessly destroyed the prey with the help of its long mouth and very sharp teeth. The remains of the contents of the Tylosaurus's stomach leave no doubt that it was an extremely dangerous predator. The remains of a shark, bird, fish, and even other mosasaurs were found inside. Apparently, the Tylosaurus attacked anyone it could find, or how else would you explain such a varied diet? Shastasaurus Long before the Tylosaurus kept the inhabitants of the world's oceans in fear, the Shastasaurus were the kings of the water. They roamed on the territory of modern North America 205 to 213 million years ago. The size of these giant ichthyosaurs was even more impressive. Their length reached 21 meters and they weighed 65 tons. It is believed that Shastasaurus' size helped them dive to great depths. Their large size also meant that they could inhale more air and stay underwater longer than smaller ichthyosaurs. They were larger than most marine predators of that time, so they could have any dish on the menu. Be it a huge mollusk or a small fish. Whatever creature got in their way, the Shastasaurus dealt with it in a rather epic way. They didn't attack the prey and didn't devour it, but literally sucked it into the mouth. The pressure was so strong that the prey had no choice but to swim into the monster's mouth, and it was impossible to get out of there. Yachilopteris the next creature in the selection wasn't as big as the Shastasaurus or the giant squid. It was only two and a half meters long. But there's one interesting detail. It was an arthropod. Just think of a modern-day crab and then imagine it ten times bigger. That's a Yucalopteris. It belonged to the genus of crustaceans and was the largest arthropod in history. Considering its incredible size, it's no surprise that the Yucalopteris felt like the king of the prehistoric bodies of water. It preferred fresh water in which it could hunt small vertebrates and trilobites, as well as its own kind. It would be terrible if this giant survived in our time, but fortunately, it has long been extinct. It died out as much as 406 million years ago and lived on the territory of modern Germany and the United States. Whale Shark but we have enough huge marine creatures in our own time, too. If we were to talk about fish, the whale shark has no equal. It is currently the largest fish on the planet, as well as the largest one of the sharks. The length of these giants often reaches 12 meters, and they can weigh as much as several tons. For a long time, it was believed that the largest recorded specimen had a length of 12.65 meters. However, in the late 90s, there was information about a whale shark that was 20 meters long and weighed 34 tons. Fortunately, whale sharks, like whales, are harmless. These giants are friendly, they don't attack people, and even let them swim nearby. The biggest shark of all time would be very angry with his descendant for being too friendly towards others. I'm talking about the sinister megalodon, of course. Even the whale shark seems tiny and insignificant when compared to the megalodon, because this prehistoric monster weighed up to 47 tons and had a length of up to 15 meters. It boasted one of the longest and sharpest teeth of all time, with which it used to crush almost any other creature. The bite force of the adult megalodon was enough to easily open the chest of a whale. Actually, it was gluttony that caused the extinction of the megalodons. Scientists believe that these monsters ate everyone they could and then couldn't handle the competition with other predators and gradually went extinct. The Anaconda The giant anaconda is a real queen of South America and beyond. It is the anaconda that holds the title of the heaviest modern-day snake. It weighs between 30 and 70 kilograms. 
However, there are exceptions, and some individuals can weigh over 100 kilograms. The incredible size and strength of the anaconda allows it to devour many creatures in South America, such as capybaras, birds, turtles, cougars, and crocodiles. The larger the anaconda, the larger prey it can eat. This is probably the largest individual ever found. It was discovered in 2016 when Brazilian construction workers were building a dam and made a series of controlled explosions in caves. They found an anaconda, which was about 10 meters long. Meanwhile, the official record holder was a little over 5 meters in length. The reptile was so huge that it had to be lifted with a crane. Friends, that's all for today. Like the video, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you next time.